Hello, this is Carmen, 30 years old. This is Jose, 23 years old. And this is Imelda, 60 years old. Approximately 1,770,000 students were homeschooled in the years 2011 and 2012. This method was first introduced in the 1970s by John Holt and Raymond Moore. A very good friend of mine was homeschooled her entire life, which is the reason why I chose to do this topic because not only did I want to be homeschooled myself, but I got to see how she did it and what she got to experience, which was basically everything I was doing in a public school. So by homeschooling children, you can customize their education, you can interact more with those children, and you can reduce the risks of them being bullied. I will begin by explaining how you can customize a children's education. First, you can cater the individual. Second, you can learn at your own pace. And third of all, you can start your college earlier. So according to an article written on pbs.org named Homeschooling, an overview written by Bridget Ben Sizer, it explains where her son began homeschooling and it allowed him to move at his own natural pace. So by this, I mean that whether the student wanted to focus more on a certain top subject or spend less time on an other subject, they got to do what he thought was best for him, what he felt he needed work on or didn't need that much work on. And you can learn at your own pace by either going so or fast on each topic as just stated and you can start your college career earlier by finishing off the entire curriculum of homeschooling so you can finish as soon as your freshman year in high school and already start taking those college courses in addition to this i will explain how parents can interact more with their children so you can have spend more time with them of course and you can have that one-on-one -on -one ratio as, as well as being adequately trained. So an article published on Community for Accredited Online Schools, it states that these programs allow parents to maximize, maximize individualized instruction and support. So you, if you wanna travel, you have the time to do so since you have this online program with the parent themselves. So you don't have to worry about, oh, I have to attend a classroom. And you have that one-on-one -on -one support so you don't have to worry about other children asking questions or taking away that time that should be yours, whether you need that help or you do not need that help. And of course, if you have a children that has disabilities, then who else better to care for that child if not the parent? Furthermore, I will explain how Bullying can also be prevented by homeschooling. So you can maintain a healthy self-esteem. You can prevent them from feeling less in, like an outsider. And you can also reduce the risks of suicide. And a June 25, 2018 article on internationalschooling.org states that 65% of bullied students say that bullying damage their self-confidence. Now, by homeschooling, you can prevent that and uh, children won't have to worry about them having like students bully them or students, other students judge them on their appearance or simply on them not being fast enough as what they are considered to be at. And you can prevent them from feeling like an outsider by if the family likes to travel, then you don't have to worry about the student having to get accustomed to each different school. You can just allow them to be themselves around family and someone who supports them. And you can reduce the risks of suicide by having them grow up in a love and knowledgeable, caring family. So that student would be comfortable in where they are and simply follow on with their goals. In conclusion, throughout this entire presentation, we saw how homeschooling can be adjusted to the student. You can customize their education. The parents can interact more with that children and how bullying can be reduced by this method. So only 3.4% of students 
are homeschooled from that entire school age population. So imagine if more parents were aware, then this method would grow even more. So the importance of homeschooling and for parents to know is very, very important, which is why I decided to make this presentation to gain more, to raise that percentage higher up.